experienced the boy speaking in languages the bed is shaking when she started to experience mysterious blackouts. Michelle from Germany. Hello family, my name is JCB and welcome to my channel Interesting Things. For many people, there is not a better feeling than sitting down in front of the TV to watch their favorite movie. And in October, because of Halloween, almost everybody searches for scary movies. But did you know that many of the scary movies that we all love to watch were actually based on real life stories? So turn off your lights and grab your popcorns because today we bring you some of the Hollywood movies that were based on real life events. Number 1 A Nightmare on Elm Street in 1984 We all didn't want to go to sleep as kids after watching this film. A supernatural stalker that searched for his prey while they sleep. Wes Craven based this movie from a strange phenomenon where a young Asian refugee would mysteriously die in her sleep. It was reported that many people refused to sleep, sitting terrifying nightmares that they said would lead them to death in their sleep. Another story from a boy in Cambodia that also refused to sleep. Everybody was telling him in his family, you must sleep, and his answer was always no. You do not understand. I have nightmares before. This is totally different. He didn't sleep for almost a week, and once he finally did, his family heard him screaming and then ran to him. But once his family was there, he had died in his sleep already. So be careful once you go to sleep tonight. Number 2. Child's Play in 1988 The film is about a possessed toy doll and voodoo. This movie was based on the case that happened in 1909 when Key West painter and author Robert Eugene Otto claimed that one of his servants placed a voodoo course on his childhood toy Robert the Doll. They said that the doll would move from room to room knocks furniture over and conduct conversations with Otto. After many years, in 1974, a new family moved to the house and found Otto the doll in the attic. This family also claimed that mysterious activities would happen in the house connected to the doll. And today, Robert the doll is on display at the Marchlow Museum those that want to text if it is really cursed. Number 3. The Exorcist in 1973 This movie gave a lot of goosebumps to many people on its time. The film is about two priests performing an exorcist on a young girl who was possessed by the devil. The screenwriter William Peter based the novel and the film on a 1949 article in the Washington Post headline. The article was about four priests participating in a read of exorcists on a boy named Roland Dew in Maryland. According to the priest, they experienced the boy speaking in languages, the bed shaking, and objects flying around during the ordeal. But we may never know what really happened to that boy. Number 4 The Conjuring in 2013 This movie is about two paranormal investigators that help the family who move into a home where happens unexplicable and paranormal events. The movie was based on the two real-life paranormal investigators Ed and Lauren Warren and their experience with the parents. A family who moved into a Rhode Island farmhouse and experienced ghostly and terrifying things that they could not just explain in 1971. Oh, and while you are watching, don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, like, comment, and share this video. Number 5 
Annabelle in 2014. This is one of the most recent movies based on a real life event. Again, from the paranormal investigators Ed and Lauren Warren. They got Annabelle from a then 28 years old woman that suspected that something was terrible wrong with it. The woman had received the doll as a gift and noticed that it started to change positions on its own and she used to find mysterious notes written on papers that said things like help me or help us and her eyes were bleeding sometimes. Then she called a medium that told her that the spirit of a girl named Annabelle Higgins was occupying the doll. Number 6. The Exorcist of Emily Rose in 2005. It is about a very young girl possessed by a devil spirit. The movie was based on the case of Annalise Michelle. She was just a teenager when she started to experience mysterious blackouts. Michelle from Germany experienced convulsions, trances and memory problems. She was diagnosed with temporal epilepsy, but Michelle was convinced that she was possessed and that she saw devil faces wherever she went and her weird voices speaking on her ears, if it's not that creepy enough. And still today, there are questions to answer about this case, but the priest were sentenced in prison for negligence. Number 7. This is not about a movie, but something very strange happened to this person while he was cleaning. Just keep looking very carefully and see what happens. And this was our video for today, so tell us which one of these movies have you dared to watch alone. I wish you a very happy and a scary Halloween and thanks a lot for watching and we we'll see you in the next video.